What is going on, guys? Grave here today. I want to talk quickly about the Riot Shield nerf that will be coming to Modern Warfare 3. And that's right, we're finally going to get a nerf to the Riot Shield, which has been pretty annoying over the last several years, not just in this particular game. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description. The community Discord, my Twitter, and of course, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. And if you have not subscribed to the channel yet, I hope you consider subscribing. We all know a lot of people use the riot shield not really for its intended purpose, but instead to have it on their back to get that extra kind of layer of protection because you can get in a gunfight with someone if they're really good movement-wise, uh, can kind of have their back to you quickly. They can put a few shots off and then kind of turn around and run from you or slide off to an angle. And in that kind of gunfight, if they have that shield on their back, you're not really going to be able to kill them. You'll have to shoot them in the feet pretty much if they're running. It's kind of hard to do. The shield has been a very annoying thing in game for the last couple years. A lot of people have been wanting it removed completely because it's not really being used, used as it was intended to be used. But there will be a nerf coming very soon. In Season 1, they will introduce a rebalance to riot shields. Uh, players will receive a movement penalty if you're using a riot, uh, riot shield, even if the shield is on your back. So you're going to get that movement penalty even if you have that right shield on your back. So not if you're holding it in front of you, it's just if it's on you, period. If you're using a right shield, whether you're using it as it's intended to be used, or if you're using it to kind of that uh, use it like a Ninja Turtle shell, as a lot of people call it, on your back, you're going to have that movement penalty. It says they should be kind of expected to have a noticeable slowdown. So it seems like it's going to be, be slowing you down a good bit, not just a small amount, a pretty good percentage, which of course then is not going to make it as useful for players using it on their back because they're going to be slower already, going to be harder to move around the map, and that kind of thing. But it's not just that they're changing. To kind of compensate for that movement penalty, the developers over at Sledgehammer will rebuff the melee damage. So now players will be able to land two hit kills with the shield instead of a three hit kill, which I do think is a fair thing. Uh, if you're going to actually make it to where you're moving slower with the shield, I think a two-hit kill as a melee kill will be better than a three just because of that movement penalty. The main reason people really wanted riot shields gone was not because of you know the melee damage. Um, it was mainly because of people wearing it on their back as, like I said, an extra layer of protection in multiplayer uh, in Warzone. You know, no matter what mode you're playing, you see people with that uh, shell on their back all the time. And it's it's kind of ridiculous. I mean, it's really uh, actually annoying if you start playing an entire team that is using it in, you know, in Warzone or in multiplayer. So it looks like Sledgehammer, once again, is listening to the, you know, kind of feedback from the community. And this nerf, like I said, will be coming at some point in Season 1. I'm hoping it's going to be with the update we will get tomorrow. But we'll kind of have to wait and see on that. Uh, but if we don't get it tomorrow, I expect to see this pretty soon. And I think a lot of people will be really happy with this. Well, at least the ones that don't wear shields. The people that wear them may not be too happy with it. But leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know what you think about this change. Are you happy to hear this? And of course, I'll catch you all next time. Peace.